Hello everyone, I'm Captain Devil Soni and today my first officer is Ayushi. Hi Ayushi. Hi sir, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Okay, so Ayushi, today we will be learning ACP which is this particular panel and the full form is audio control panel. Okay. Okay. So as the name suggests, it is used to control the audio. So as you can see, there are so many knobs here, right? This is VHF1, VHF2, VHF3, HF1, HF2, and cabin. Okay. Okay. So this is, when you press this, this will pop out. Okay. So pop out means the receiver is on. It means the VHF1 receiver is on. So whatever transmission is going on, on VHF, you will be able to receive that. Okay. And if it is down, it means the receiver is off. off. You will not be able to hear maybe from your loudspeaker on your, or, or your headset. Okay. So to receive the voice, you have to keep it pop out. Okay. This is your transmit transmission key when you press this this will become green it means the transmission is on okay so to transmit let's say you want to transmit on vh one then you will this will this should be in the green okay so the your transmission will go if this is pop out you will be able to hear clear yeah now at one time we can only speak to one person right right yeah so any one of them should be selected. Okay. If you want to speak on VHF2, then we will press this. This will become green. And the knob of VHF2. E. And the and the knob of VHF2 should be popped out. Yeah. Means receiver should be on okay. to hear that voice. Okay. So let's say, and, and this is for VHF3. This is for HF1. So let's say if you want to communicate with HF frequency, and you want to obviously listen to it also. If you are transmitting, you obviously, you know, on a list, have to be on the listening side as well. Yeah. So, HF1 should be popped out, receiver on. And you want to transmit on HF1, then you will press this HF1. Hmm. Clear? Yeah. Then this is int. Let's say you want to talk to uh, a ground, which is uh, an engineer, which is below the aircraft. Then you will use this. Int. Okay, then maybe if you want to use the cabin, you know, if you want to speak to cabin attendant and all, then you will use this. Is that clear? Yeah. Okay. This is for intercom. Let's say you don't want to press those your PTT button on the joystick. In whatever you speak, let's say if both of us are, you know, are intercom, then we don't need to press any button. We'll be able to, you know, communicate. Okay. And let's say this is this is rad. It means if we if we if we keep on pressing this, it means then we don't need to press any button. Okay, we don't need to press PTT button. We'll be able to. It's it 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 is like a you know trans. I mean it is it is like a transmission key only. But you have to keep it pressed until the time it is pressed. You will be able to transmit. This is uh, let's say if you get a buzzer. Okay, let's say the cabin attendant is calling you. So you will get a buzzer here. Okay, so this light will be on in amber. So to reset that, to reset that buzzer, you will press this reset. Okay. What do you mean by reset as in to uh, like communicate to them? Or So it's like, let's say the cabin crew is calling you from the cabin. Okay, so they will press a button over there. So you will get a a horn okay in the cockpit and you will get a light over, over here as well okay to to reset that horn because otherwise it will continue horning okay right so just to reset that horn you will yeah. press this reset yeah okay and if you want to speak to then then you will speak to her or him that's like uh, you know i mean uh, uh, you want to communicate with them then you will press this okay and then you will communicate this okay this on voice is, um, uh, let's say you tune to any VOR, 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल ओके इन टू एनी व्यू आर फ्रीक्वेंसी तो इनिशियली लेट्स यू ट्यून टू इट इस विच इज ऑल्सो इन व्यू आर फ्रीक्वेंसी सो एज यू नो दैट यू नो वी आर विल गिव यू एन आइडेंटिफिकेशन सिग्नल्स ऑल्सो डिट डिट दैट दैट डिट डिट ऑल दोज थिंग्स सो दैट विल बी इन इरीटेटिंग सो यू विल प्रेस दिस ऑन वॉइस सो दैट साउंड विल नॉट बी हर्ट ओके ओके दिस इज फोर पी ए लाइक इफ यू वॉन्ट टू हियर वट्स हैपनिंग वट वट इज द पैसेंजर अनाउंसमेंट इज गोइंग ऑन ओके देन यू कैन पॉप दिस आउट यू कैन स्विच ऑन दिस रिसीवर okay then you will be able to hear passenger announcement done by either me or you oh okay so let's say if i am doing a passenger announcement and if you turn on the receiver then you will be able to hear that what is my announcement clear and how do you do it like how so, yes so doing a passenger announcement there are uh, ways like you can press this pa key okay and then you can you know, you know using your uh, you know headset okay you can just press this and you can do an announcement okay okay and there is a one uh, headset also pressing that also it's like a phone yeah pressing that button over here and then also you could do the announcement okay okay clear then these frequencies again so let's say um, this is vr1 vr2 So, if you want to hear the identification signals, okay, of particular V O one or V O two or any particular marker beacons or I L S, M L S, A D O one and A D O two out, okay. So then you can, uh, you know, switch on the receivers and you'd be able to hear the identification of that particular V O R or I L S or uh, marker beacons. So identification signals means those, uh, you know, they they gives you the, their names. Like this is, you know, Delta Papa November. This is Juliet, Papa, you know, uh, uh, Romeo. It's a Jaipur VR or whatever. Okay, so this is how it is used. Any doubts, Ayushi? Oh, we have like multiple keys for VR, like VR one, VR two. Yes. And also for VHF. Yes. So is it for redundancy purpose? Yes. So, uh, you know, for um, absolutely. So, let's say for redundancy also. And if you want to use, let's say, two VR at one time. Okay. So let's say, um, let's say you are in in the middle of Delhi to Jaipur. Okay. So you can use Delhi VR also and Jaipur VR also yeah. at the same time. Now it's like it's like making use of two resources at one time. Okay. So that is the reason we can use multiple viewers at one time, and it can be used for redundancy as well. Okay. I hope it. Uh, Clarify your doubt. Yeah. Any other doubts? So, uh, if we are talking about audio, so one thing which fascinates me a lot is the interpilot frequency you have. Okay. So from from where do you communicate yeah. it? So this is a frequency set. It is done on RMP. Yeah. Okay. It is RMP is this panel. Okay. So we do it on VHF two. Okay. And then we will let's say that frequency is one, one two, two three decimal four, four five. five. Absolutely correct. One two three four five, and you will press this. The standby will become active. Oh. So it is selected on VHF two. Then you have to press this VHF two to transmit on VHF two. Yeah. And then you can ask, hi, uh, you know, your friend, what time is the landing? Okay, let's uh, go for the party. After yeah. That. Okay. Anything else? Uh, no, sir. Okay, good, great. So uh, I enjoyed flying with you, Ayushi. Lovely hey. flying. Thank you for having me. Sure. Thank you so much. And um, if you have some more doubts, if you want to learn something, if you want to know something, please let us know, and we'll be happy to put uh, this uh, your query, your doubts, as our uh, video. Thank you so much. I'm Captain David Soni. Thank you. Thank you.